Okay guys, so we're always looking at our reference. So let's start blocking. So here's my reference. I've got it ready here. This, let's go through this. First pose is probably going to be this one, yeah? Okay. So we just grab everything, key it. Let's put this at zero. Everything's keyed. Then we go to frame four. And I'm just thinking about the hips. So he's getting hit forward and the energy is hitting his stomach so you want to make sure that he's down and his head is like taking the force but then his shoulders shoulders are you can translate them higher because they're taking the force right and then his arm is kind of taking it as well so you want to get those nice curves in this arm we could change it by bringing it in contrast remember don't worry about the fingers we'll do that at the end uh, coming in raise this up a bit the thing is we don't want to make it look like it's twinning so we we'll kind of have it up like this bring this in okay kind of in like this so it's following an arc right If it's coming in like that, that would be better, isn't it? Like that. There's more of a flow then. Yeah, there's more of a flow there. What we'll do, we'll just make, make this constant. So it's pose to pose. So next pose. Next pose is back like this. So it's taking it, it's like a passing position. So what we'll do is we'll just look at the hips first. The hips are completely that way right so we know the hips are back that way and facing towards this leg because the weight will be on this leg and then it will be high and this way because this leg will be in the air they're like this if I straighten that up a bit Bring that out. Just make sure it's following the toe. So like that. And this kind of like, this is rotated enough, yeah, here. But it's kind of leaning back a bit and then we want the other controllers to have them lean back. And then the next one is leaning back and then the top one is leaning as well. But we're trying to we're trying to get that so if I get his arm out that's out here to balance This one is coming back there. Now what we can do, I think this is too much, the rotation. This one, we can, yeah, it's a bit too much. But then the top, what we'll do, we'll just rotate this. We just want to create that arc like that on the back so it's taken a hit just 
trying to see this new balance thing. Um, so it's taking a hit. Key that. I'll just save this. Save your work. Save your work. Okay. And what we'll do, we'll just again. Constant interpolation. Sometimes it doesn't work. You have to like select everything, go to flat or control F, what I press, and then constant. And now it should. I don't know why it's not doing that. It's very strange. Oh, I didn't key on everything. Yeah. I didn't key on everything. Naughty, naughty. Let's get rid of that. Okay. What is this? Hmm, strange. It's very strange when I press constant. Anyway. Oh. Okay, weird stuff is happening here. Maybe it's a Maya bug but anyway. Got that pose, then it's going back. And now there's a step, there's a step. So there's a step back, right? He's looking down at the step back. So let's add that. So he's looking down. step back and then I'll just zero all these out bring it back let's have it as a step yeah it's still like that mm, that's like a ball ballerina there isn't it? look at that <laughs> Okay. Okay, and then the, the hips. I can see that it's going forward like this. What we'll do? We'll just rotate this leg a bit as well because this is all broken. But we'll, we'll fix that. What we want to do is have this character looking down at the leg. And this arm comes down, trying to balance. That's completely off balance, as you can see. So what we do, we move this forward. Oops, we move this forward. Move it like that. That's more better. And then there's a it, there's a land there. The leg is slightly bent. This arm is down. <laughs> 